Nvidia have just introduced Reflex 2, an evolution of the original Reflex technology that launched five years ago. This upgraded version promises up to 75% lower latency thanks to a new feature called Frame Warp. In games like Valorant, where high frame rates are achievable for most players, Nvidia have recorded one of their lowest latency figures ever, which is amazing news for any gamer out there who's chasing the lowest input latency possible to gain that complexity competitive edge. Now you may be wondering what exactly does the reflex technology do to improve response times and to answer this we need to go back to 2020 where Nvidia were focusing on optimizing how the CPU and GPU work together. When they made reflex this basically ensured that your actions like moving your mouse or pressing the key were processed and displayed faster in game. They did this by syncing up the CPU and GPU tasks eliminating those unnecessary delays in the render queue which led to noticeable lower input latency. If we fast forward to today in 2025, Nvidia have taken this even further with their new Reflex 2. The key innovation in Reflex 2 is that frame warp technology I mentioned earlier where if you imagine a simple action like moving to the right instead of waiting for a new frame to fully render, Reflex 2 will warp an already rendered frame to match your latest mouse input. Just as it is, this frame warping could look super glitchy or out of sync. So to fix that, Nvidia developed a predictive rendering algorithm that uses prior frames, color data, and depth data to intelligently fill in those gaps caused by the camera shift. This is called in-patent technology, and it smooths out all the inconsistencies, ensuring that your actions are reflected on screen instantly without those visual glitches like I mentioned earlier. So what makes Reflex 2 better than Reflex 1? Well, from Nvidia blog post you can see that there is up to 75% lower latency with the keyword being up to so don't expect it to be crazy but it will still be significantly better than reflex one for sure from what I've read on the blog post I think it's definitely recommended for those out there that want the fastest response times to use this especially if you're one of them people out there that use the reflex latency mode on on plus boost or even on I mean from the comparison chart right here you can see the significant difference between having a off having it on reflex one and then having it on the brand new reflex two keep in mind this is for a specific game with high settings in other games like valorant where you get much higher fps this is going to be insane and i think it's going to be the standard for everyone to use now for those wondering when reflex 2 will be available it comes out with a new rtx 50 series gpus but what's amazing about it is it won't be exclusive to those brand new series of cards it's actually going to be available to every RTX GPU so if you own an RTX graphics card you will soon be able to take advantage of Reflex 2 which is amazing. Also the first games to support it will be the Finals and Valorant but you can expect other games like Fortnite and CSGO 2 to shortly follow after. But yeah it seems like the Nvidia Reflex 2 isn't just an upgrade but is also a huge innovation in technology. I think it looks amazing for anyone out there that wants to have the lowest latency possible so let me know your your thoughts on it in the comment section below. Before you go, feel free to check out any of my other videos that are on screen right now.